Hey guys, welcome back to Click Academics. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to solve one of the hardest math Olympiad problems. All right, so we have 3 to the power of x is equal to 7 to the power of x plus 2. Now, I actually have two methods of solving this problem. So let's first start with method 1. And so we have 3 to the power of x is equal to 7 to the power of x plus 2. And an important property of exponents is that if I have something in the form a to the power of m plus n, this is equal to a to the power of m times a to the power of n. So the exponent essentially distributes with the base. So right here we have 7 to the power of x plus 2. And this is going to equal 7 to the power of x times 7 to the power of 2. So now I have 3 to the power of x is equal to 7 to the power of x times 7 squared. Now I can divide both sides by 7 to the power of x. So now I have 3 to the power of x over 7 to the power of x is equal to these two cancel out, so simply 7 squared. 7 squared now is equal to 49. So I have 3 to the power of x over 7 to the power of x is equal to 49. Now, if I have something in the form a to the power of m over b to the power of m, this is actually equal to a over b to the power of m. So right here, 3 to the power of x over 7 to the power of x, this is going to equal 3 over 7 to the power of x. So now I have 3 over 7 to the power of x is equal to 49. Now I can take the log on both sides. So now I have log of 3 over 7 to the power of x is equal to log 49. Now, an important property of logarithms is that if I have something in the form log a to the power of b, this is equal to, I can actually move this exponent b to the front of the logarithm. So this would be equal to b times log a. So for log 3 over 7 to the power of x, I can move this exponent x to the front of the logarithm. So this would be equal to x times log 3 over 7. So now I have x times log 3 over 7 is equal to log 49. So now I can divide both sides by log 3 over 7. So then these two cancel out and I'd be left with x is equal to log 49 over log 3 over 7, which is the same thing as log base 3 over 7 of 49. Now my second method to solve this problem is well, our initial problem was 3 to the power of x is equal to 7 to the power of x plus 2. So I'm going to first take the log on both sides. So now I have log 3 to the power of x is equal to log of 7 to the power of x plus 2. 
And remember, an important property of logarithms is that if I have something in the form log a to the power of b, I can move this exponent b to the front of the logarithm. So this would be equal to b times log a. So for log 3 to the power of x here, I can move this exponent x to the front. So I have x times log 3 is equal to, same goes with 7 to the power of x plus 2. I can move this exponent to the front. So I have x plus 2 times log 7. Now, I can actually distribute this log 7 and multiply this. So I have x plus 2 times log 7. So if I distribute our log 7 here, I have x times log 3 is equal to log 7 times x. So log uh, or x times log 7 plus 2 times log 7. So 2 log 7. Now I can go ahead and subtract x times log 7 on both sides. So now I have x times log 3 minus x times log 7 is equal to 2 times log 7. Now from these two terms, I can simply factor out x because both of these terms have x in them. So now I have x times, now x times log 3 divided by x is simply just log 3. And minus x times log 7 over x is simply log 7. And this is still equal to 2 times log 7. And now I have x over here, and we want to isolate x, obviously. So I'm going to divide both sides by log 3 minus log 7. So now these two cancel out, and I have x is equal to 2 times log 7 over log 3 minus log 7. And now if I have something in the form log a minus log b, this is the same thing as log a over b. So log 3 minus log 7, this would be equal to log 3 over 7. And if I have something in the form a times log b, this is the same thing as log b to the power of a, because remember, we can actually move this exponent to the front. So 2 times log 7, this would equal log 7 squared, which is equal to log 49. So now I have log 49 over log 3 over 7.